So I, this is my first live stream. I don't know what I'm doing. Is that obvious? Okay. So I have a lot to get through. I'm going to just start going through things and getting it out of the way. And uh, yeah, so first I guess I will go with records that I bought recently. And that would be bought Kiefer Sutherland's album. Uh, you could get this at Barnes & Noble only. And it was, oh, how much was it? I used a coupon on their Black Friday sale. So I believe it was like $16, which is pretty good. I already put it in. It's plastic. And I have the record actually on my turntable. So you can't see that. But it's black vinyl. It doesn't really matter. Um, I also got, I have things in random bags. That, this isn't actually the stores that I bought them from. Um, I got Pure Comedy by Father John Misty. This was also on sale. Well, it wasn't on sale. I used coupons and some gift cards, so I ended up paying like $10 for it, and it still had its code in it, and I have this inside because uh, he does this with his albums. He puts the, the uh, label for the record, what it is, and then the tracks on the plastic itself, so I have to cut those off and put it in the sleeve once I put it in its special sleeve that I make. This is going to be the problem, finding places to put things. I also got the hair soundtrack from the movie. I already had the Broadway production or the, you know, the stage production, but this was only $4, and then after the sale and everything, it was cheap coupon, gift cards, not sale, whatever. Anyway, I also got uh, The Martian by Andy Weir. Weir? I'm not sure how to pronounce that. Uh, it was marked down to $7.99, and then I, again, gift card, coupon. I got The Room, The Definitive Guide. Definitive? Definitive? I can't talk today. Anyway, so that's why I'm live, obviously, uh, because of that. Oh, I have a bad connection. Mm. So this might be a really bad video, and then you're really going to be SOL. Anyway, so The Room, if you haven't seen it, it's like the world's worst movie, but best movie? Don't know really how to say it other than that. So I just got the guide because it's funny. I wanted to read about it. I still have to get the disaster artist, the book, and then the movie's coming out soon. Good times, good times. So if it wasn't obvious, oh, shiitake mushrooms. I don't have it over here. Oh, well. So I don't have the things I actually got from Think Geek in here because this was kind of a last minute thing. I had to get everything in one room because I'm going to start wrapping things soon and it's really late at night. So I had to wait for everybody to go to bed. And I just, and I was like, oh, I should film this. I may as well. That's kind of my thing here, obviously. Um, but uh, this is what happens. I get scatterbrained. Uh, but I think Geek, they had a sale. I got the Impost, Imposters, Imposters. I'm not sure which one it is. They like to do play on words. Anyway, um, the Batgirl as Harley Quinn, or Harley Quinn as Batgirl, whichever you want to put it. Because somebody else had gifted me the Loot Crate exclusive Joker Batman so I wanted a Harley Quinn Batgirl to go with it. Uh, and it was $6, and then they had buy two, get one free, and it included their their mystery things that came in wrappers like this. And so I got two of these packs, and I got, uh, I thought I had picked out an It one, because, you know, I felt it, but unfortunately it was uh, Pinhead Hellraiser. I'm not, not such a fan, but I gave it to uh, my mom. She liked it. But I did get... Freddy Krueger, which was really easy to pick out if you can feel his hat. So if you want Freddy Krueger, feel for the hat. It's really obvious which one he is. Let's go with Blu-rays. I've got lots of those. It'll get them out of the way. All right. At Target, I got Hateful Eight on DVD, which you will find out later. I wish I had waited until I went to Best Buy. Um, but it was $4 at uh, Target. And I got the DVD because my friend it's a gift for my friend, and she only has a DVD player and refuses to get a Blu-ray. Now, again, I wish I had got... I waited because at... Oh, it's probably not over here. Yeah. At Best Buy, they had this Blu-ray DVD combo pack for $4, which is how much I paid for this one. So I wish I would gotten her this one because then I could just, you know, give her... This, you know, and she'd still have the DVD and the digital version. And then if she ever got a Blu-ray player, she'd have that option. But I'm stupid, and I did not. But this one's cooler. I mean, I th she'll probably like the slipcover better for this one anyway. So I also got myself the Hateful Eight because it was $4. And I was like, I may as well because I like the Blu-ray. And I like the movie. I don't know what I'm talking about. I got The World's End at Walmart, and it was $1.96. And I just got it on DVD, 
because I have the Steelbook and uh, the Steelbook Blu-rays of both Shaun of the Dead and Hot Fuzz. So just to complete it, I didn't really like this one. I know that might piss off some people, but I wanted to complete the trilogy. I know you don't have to, but I wanted to. And that was just the cheapest way to complete it. I also got the Santa Claus on Blu-ray. Uh, it was $9.96, $10. And I've just wanted this movie for such a long time, and this is the cheapest I found it. I know it's probably been cheaper at some point, but that's what it was. I also got Elf. It was $5.96, so $6. These last few have been from Walmart. Okay. Uh, also from Target, this was 4 or $6. I can't remember which one. I think it might have been $6. Deadpool, I've already seen watched that one before I had a chance to film this. Uh, Fantastic Beasts and Where to Find Them. This was $6 at Target. Kingsman, $6 at Best Buy. Krampus, $6 at Best Buy. They had to find this for me. The gal hunted it down. There was supposed to be four left in the store, but she could only find one. And she's like, I think the other ones have sold. It just hasn't updated. So I got the last one in the entire store. Moana it was $7.96 or $7.99. Something like that. $7.99 probably. And it was seventy ninety six on Amazon, but then I would have had to wait, so may as well get it for three cents more. It's only three cents. Walking Dead, Blu-ray, complete third season. This was six ninety nine, so seven dollars, I believe. Cabin in the Woods, love this movie. It was ten dollars, which I would normally not spend because it's been out for a while, but it's ten dollars. It's four K. I do not have a four K TV. I do not have a four K player, but it comes with Blu-ray and digital HD. And I have Blu-ray, and I can watch it on my computer. So it works for me. And in case I ever get a 4K, I have that option. Plus, it's the other ones have been remastered. Because I've watched it, and it looks better than the, the Blu-ray that I had before. Which went missing, which is why I actually needed to get that. This was at Target, and it is a complete sixth season. And it's the Steelbook. Now, they only advertised that their the regular Blu-ray was um, on sale, and it was for $10. Um... But I went in the back hoping to find other copies of some of the movies that I couldn't find in, you know, those cardboard displays they put out. And I saw this one. And I was like, hmm, I render. I scanned it. And it came up as $10, too, because they all share the same UPC or whatever it's called. So when it's Black Friday, obviously, this isn't going to help you now for sale days. If they put a movie on, or a movie, a series, whatever, on sale or clearance, check other versions because they might be just as much on sale, so. And then this was at Best Buy as well, and this is the complete fifth season. It was $9.99, so 10 bucks. So I almost have all of them now. I'm missing the fourth and the seventh. Now I have them all. Uh, may as well grab this one. This is all the way back from Halloween stuff, but it's for Christmas. They're for Christmas presents, so that's why I'm having them in this haul. I got these for my friend because she's kind of weird and likes gothic kind of stuff. I got this for my other friend because he likes skull things. And then these are just stocking stuffers for my friend who likes the roses. So there's these ones and some nice eyelashes and black lipstick. Because she, she has a stocking here. Uh, she doesn't do, she doesn't have a good... Uh, family option. So she comes here for Christmas and uh, she gets a stocking. So she needs stocking stuffers. Uh, this is for my other friend. She really likes Nightmare Before Christmas. Obviously, I, oh, I haven't been saying prices, but you get this stuff during their clearance. Like these, everything that I just showed you was less than a dollar each. Like most of them were less than a quarter. Like this was 59 cents. So obviously more than a quarter, but you know what I mean. Uh, like these were, uh, 19 cents each. This I think was like 39 cents. So yeah, just, you stock up, man. This pillow was a dollar. So, all right, let's see. I got, these are my Christmas pajamas for this year. They were, well, they weren't sold as a set, but I pieced them together. And I got Mickey Mouse with Santa hat on. And then these really soft flannel pajama pants. And all together, they were like, after my... I got a $5 off coupon and then a 15% off coupon and then with the sale price, because it's, again, Black Friday, um, I believe it came to, like, 10 bucks, if that, for the whole set. So it's pretty darn good. 
Let's see, more Halloween stuff. I got this and this for my friend and her boyfriend because they call each other Jack and Sally, so I thought that would be cute for them. Uh, they were uh, 59 cents for one and then 49 cents for the other because uh, the, the gal was weird. I don't know. She just, the thing was five ninety nine, and so she should have charged me 59 cents. The manager came over, told her to do so. And, uh, for some reason she put in 49 cents. I don't know why, but this is the sound of me. That's a, that's a sum sum for you. Um, and then I got these to go with, um, Jack and Sally. And the, these were, should have been 49 cents, but for one, she charged me 39 cents. I don't know, man. I don't, I don't know. Um, I got this. Either I'm going to put it in, uh, my mom's stocking or my friend's stocking or, uh, as a gift pack for that other thing. It's, it was just kind of a filler. It was only like 39 cents. So why not? I got this cause there's supposed to be a UV, um, dance. I go to a, a da social dance each week and they were going to have a UV dance at some point and so I got this to uh, put in my hair obviously I got this to go with this for my friend because her nickname uh, is kitty so but the kitty cat mask I thought it was cute and then I got this one for myself to try it is a sugar skull so they made the scent sugar cookie which I thought was funny all right that is just a bag so quickly toss in get out of the way okay um let's see uh, we'll go with thrift stuff real quick. I found this dress. This is Goodwill. It's really pretty. Goes like that. It still has its original tags for $235, which is crazy talk. Um, I think my friend has called dibs on it, so it's not going to be here much longer. <laughs> uh, I finally found a jean jacket. Oh, I paid $0.99 cents for that, by the way. I paid $0.99 cents for this. Well, the, all the clothes items I paid $0.99 cents for. But I've been wanting a jean jacket for a while so that I could add patches and buttons and pens and things. But I haven't been able to find one. Finally, I found one. I'm so excited for 99 cents. I'm so excited. Okay. I got this for my friend. It still has its tag on and everything. It's Italian made fabric. It still has the inner button on it too. So, yeah, I think she'll like it. I don't know anything about this brand. Babaton? Babaton. Babaton. I became in. I got this jacket for myself. It's very 80s, but I love it. It's by Herman K. Obviously, also 99 cents, but it's gonna be so good for the winter. Sorry for all the noise. I got this for my mom's husband. He needs collared shirts for work. So I found this one. And it's Lacoste, Lacoste, whatever you want to say. Um, and this still has its original price tag for, uh, $79. So, I highly recommend thrifting for some Christmas gifts if you, uh, have a budget. I got this for my other friend. I think she'll like it. I hope it fits. It's stretchy, so it should fit. This still has its original tag on for $10.99. And then I got this for my other friend. And this still has its tag on, but it doesn't have a price tag on it. But I think it would have been like $30 or $40 because it's London Times. Well, we'll go with this bag. Why not? Uh, another thing I got for $0.99 cents at the thrift store. Uh, I'm giving this gift is to another friend. They don't watch my channel, so they're not going to see this. So it doesn't matter if I'm ruining it. Another shirt from my mom's husband. Go away, noisy bag. It still has its tags on. And it is from... Where was it from? The House of Scotland Golf. This was, again, nine... No, this was, uh, 350 That's how much it was. So, that's not too bad, though. Alright, let's go. Oh, not everything in here is Old Navy. I got Carrie on Blu-ray and DVD. Yeah, and digital download. Uh, but it was only $1.99. So I got this as a stocking stuffer for my mom. And I got this as a gift to go with the Jack or the Sally stuff from my one friend. And it's so 
kitty fluffy socks. These were a dollar at Old Navy. I got myself a couple pairs, but I've worn them already, so they're not here. And they were the llama pack and the ones that to me look like a chihuahua. Um, so what else do I have? Oh, I got this at uh, Barnes & Noble. It's a Steven Universe mystery mini thing. It was only like $2.50. I wasn't originally going to get it, but I felt bad having just asked the guy. They weren't marked, and I, it always bothers me having to ask them. So I was like, oh, all right, two fifty. dollars I get this, that, and the things, and then, okay, she, that person's done. I'm done. I'm done. Um, oh, more records. <laughs> Oh, well, one more record. I got this for my mom. Most people would be like, why are you getting something so used? She really loves Herman's Hermits. And this was only $2, and she doesn't have any of their records. And so I'm going to clean it up and put it in a sleeve and everything, and that will be the Christmas gift for her. I also got Rock and Rolla as a stocking stuffer for her husband. He really likes that movie. And then I got the complete season 7 of Archer on DVD. It was like seven bucks or six dollars, something like that, at um, Best Buy. All right. Also from Kohl's, this just jumps all over. I can't even sort this video for you later because uh, it'll be uh, everywhere. So I hope I'm keeping you entertained. Um, I got this for another friend. So now he's all done. It's a Slytherin t-shirt. It was cheap. It came to like three dollars after the sales. Um, let's think what else do we have? I have a sweater for another friend, still had its original tags on. I have random bikini bits for my other friend who, oh, that's coming untied. That's awesome. Uh, these are, you know, when Target has overstock or it's out of season, they give things to the Goodwill. If you don't, yeah, they do. That's what they do. And um, my friend one time, we, we planned a whole trip. We went to the beach. And she, knows, she knew that's where we were going, and um, it was only after we got there, she was like, oh, um, so I don't have a bathing suit. I was like, but I asked you before we left my house, because I was joking when I asked her, but I, I said that. And, and she was like, oh, I thought you meant if I was wearing a bathing suit, and I said no. I'm like, that's, that's not what she said, but okay. Um, so I'm as kind of a joke, I'm, I've got her some bathing suit bits, and I'm going to just make a box full of bathing suit parts. They're only 99 cents a piece, and they still have their tags on because they're just overstocked from Target and other stores. I got this for another friend. She's obsessed with scarves. Scarves. And, uh, again, 99 cents. Everything's falling. And it's for the same friend with the scarves. And it's a dress once I can unravel it. There we go. But, you know, yeah, okay, interesting. It's an interesting fabric. I have no idea what's going on with it. All right, from Macy's, I got this for another friend. Da, 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 da. This will have been free once I get the rebate in. I got this for another friend, also free once I get the rebate in. Let's put you back in here, get you out of the way. And then I got two pillows also. That will be free once the rebate comes in. All right, what do we have in here? Oh, more uh, Halloween stuff, but again get stuff when it's on sale. Got this for 30 cents for the friend who likes skull stuff. I got this for 5 cents. I still don't know what I'm going to put in it, but it was 5 cents. I got this for the friend who likes skull stuff. This was 30 cents. I'm just making like a gift basket thing. It's just what I do, man. Okay, what's that? No, I did that. No, I did that. Okay, this one. I'm not scatterbrained. Also from Target. I got this for $10. Uh, she likes Supernatural. I like Supernatural. Oh, that reminds me, there's something else over there. I'm not going to go grab it, but it's over there. And it's a Supernatural calendar that I got, and it was only $5. And it comes with a calendar, and I think two posters. Maybe it was just one, but mm, something like that. Uh, and then this, did I say that was for my mom? If I didn't, that's who that is for. I also got this for her, because she's been wanting a new nightgown, so I got one. And it was like $10 after the sale and coupons. I got this for her husband, and this was like $2 after sale and coupons and those gift card thingies that they give out at JCPenney. I got this for my mom to go with the slippers, and these were like $2 after the sale and coupons and stuff. And then I got this to go with the green shirt for my friend. 
And this was like $3 after the sale and coupons. Because he's always like, girls are always stealing my flannels. So I'm like, okay, well, a girl is going to give you flannels. Like, look at, look at how many receipts I had to get because I had to do multiple transactions. Because you can only use one, one of those coupons per transaction. So I was just like, can I do a bunch of transactions? And they were like, yeah. Probably because they just didn't want to uh, cause a stink. Because I don't think that's probably allowed. But they did because they're awesome. And that's some good customer service. And they give you these really nice bags. Because we have a ban on plastic bags. So they've started giving these away. And they don't charge for them. Yeah, I have a bad connection, YouTube. Deal with it. Okay. I feel, oh, I was like, I feel like there's more, because there is, basically, is what I'm saying right now. Okay. I'm almost done, though. I promise. Okay. I got this dress, which is, I'll tell you a little story that goes with this dress. So I got this dress, and it's so pretty, and it has, like, a cool crisscross, because I was going to wear it for Christmas for swing, right? Because I go swing dancing. That's one of the social dances I go to. And it was only 99 cents. And it's the brand uh, Adrena Papel, whatever, whatever that is. But um, uh, then like an hour after I bought that dress, uh, there was a notification that said, there will be no more swing. My sad panda. So uh, they're not doing swing dancing anymore. And I only got to do it for like a little over a year. And that makes them a third. Oh, well. I got this because I have been invited to three Christmas parties, and so I'm going to wear this dress at two of them, because one of them has an ugly sweater party thingy, and I don't, I don't really have an ugly sweater, but I figure this is still a sweater, and it's Christmassy, so I'm going to wear this, and then, I don't know if it's over here, but I also got um, a set of earrings, and actually I don't know where that bag is. I should find that bag. It might be over there, and I'm just stupid. Um, but I got a pair of earrings that are candy canes and a necklace that's a candy cane that matches. So I figure I'll do that. Oh, and if you care, this is Black Label by Evan Picone, Picone, Pisson, Pichon. Uh, this is how well I pronounce things. Oh, I still got a bad connection. That's awesome. Oh, no, it's in this bag and I'm stupid. That's fine. <clears throat> oh, I got this dress. These were also 99 cents. This has the original tag on it. And this is Bissot, 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 Bissot. Uh, $60 originally. Got this as a gift for a friend. And to go with that, I got this set of paparazzi. That's what they're called. Oh, no, 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 no. Okay. It's a set that's a necklace and some earrings. This were 99 cents as well. I mean, some people are probably going to say that I'm being cheap, but considering I'm working on savings and I don't have a job right now, I'm taking a break, uh, I got to just go with what I got. And so that's what I can afford until I get full time work again. This is the earrings and necklace that I was talking about. This is my horrible, horrible nails. And yeah, it's up pretty. Um, you go over there. And so, yeah, I had gotten these earrings to go, <laughs> to be able to wear during swing. And, uh, yeah, then I found out, you know, that there, there is no more swing. Please focus, camera. It's probably not going to. This is a phone. And they don't like doing that. Okay. That one's done. Uno mas. And then I got proper vintage garland. I love this stuff. And this is made in Italy. For some reason so it's made, made in Italy and uh, I don't know what year it's from probably the 50s I paid two dollars for it it was marked three dollars but it had a two dollar tag on it so that's the one I showed and then they still looked at it so they could have charged me more but that's the one I got charged because I was like well this one's on here so try to charge me that price <laughs> but it's it's a really pretty gold like I don't know if it's really picking up but yeah and it'll look really nice in my room I have a white and gold theme, if that word's obvious. Oh, that reminds me. I also got this guy over here, but he might be too hard to grab. He's already on his way. Oh, don't break. Isn't he cool? He was 99 cents. I love this guy. Uh, go back over here, Santa. Or Father Christmas, whatever you want to call. Come on, come on. All right. And then I also got a little vintage, like, 
glass angel, but uh, she's up there, and I don't want to try taking her down right now. And I think that's it. That's it. Yay. I'm done. I mean, I've gotten other things since I've made videos, but that would take forever to show everything because I'm very much a thrifty shopper, and I was needing Christmas stuff, so, you know, I got, I got things as I needed them. So, yeah. I think that's more than enough for this darn uh, live stream. Oh, I got this sweater, too. Let's let's just give some love for this sweater. This very 80s sweater. It's 99 cents, and I kind of dig it. So, yeah. That's it. This, is, this has been long enough. I hope you enjoyed, and absolutely nobody watched this, but that's okay, because hopefully you'll watch it once it's saved and goes, not live, but back up, whatever it's called. Thank you for anyone who does watch, and I'm going to now have to lean towards the screen uh, to press finish. So I, I hope uh, that's, yeah. If you liked it, please do subscribe. I'm going to try and update more regularly. The reason I had to do live this time is because I've just been having a real hard time with my editing software. And if I bothered to do that, it would just, i never get it done, obviously, because I have so many videos I haven't been able to post. Uh, so yeah, please look. Oh, I hate doing this, but please like and subscribe. Um, I promise I will do my best to get better. Okay? Thank you. Bye-bye. Happy holidays. should say that. All right. Bye-bye.